What is the Red Bull Fluke Tog? Oh, this is an exceptional day when the most exceptional people gather together in various cities of the various countries of the world. People who dream of flying. The Red Bull Flugtag is famous the world over as a festival of homemade flying machines. And it's not just a festival, but a competition. Each Red Bull Flugtag is a huge media event. Why not turn it into a unique tool for self-promotion? Sure, that's just what we need. Our awesome plan for Flugtag 2013. One, to become world famous, not only as a creative agency, but also as bona fide aeronauts. Two, to exercise our gray matter with this unusual task and to come up with a wild idea that will make it through the jury's strict selection process. Three, to test our production department with this ultimate challenge and to create the winning flying machine. Four, to take wing. Five, and as it should be, to have fun. Six, to become world famous. Ah, I already mentioned that one. And in the meanwhile, we submitted our entry request. So, out of the more than 2,500 teams who sent in entry requests, only 500 were selected to submit their designs. Of these, only the 200 most original made it to the shortlist, and only 36 teams were actually allowed to take to the air. And Beetle was one of them. Our idea was simple, as is everything genius. We won up them with the sheer fact that as the flying machine would unavoidably end up in the water, we decided then let it be for a good reason. Let the Beetle team soak the Mantu test. <laughs> The Mantu test is a tuberculosis skin test which must remain completely dry. That's the trick! So, the long and thorough phase of implementing the idea began. We engaged our own production facilities as well as the expertise of professional plane builders. Finally, the apparatus was ready. The pilot had butterflies in his stomach in anticipation. And here it comes, the fluke tug. Stroganol, more than 100,000 spectators and live TV broadcasts, hundreds of media present, television channels and the press, and Beetle was in the epicenter itself. When one team member was tired of giving interviews, another would take his place. In between the interviews, the team was preparing a spectacular pre-flight show, because the jury not only took into consideration the distance of the flight and the creativity of the flying apparatus itself, but also a brilliant performance. Oh, the Mantu test really got drenched that day, as it should have. All the judges awarded us 10 points and the silver iron, the well-deserved prize for second place goes to Beetle, an epic win. Post-flight debriefing. Well, flying is a great thing, but let's get down to business. According to our most modest computations, the name of the team and the agency was mentioned in at least 50 video reports and central newscasts. It also appeared in more than 100 reviews and blogs. Our beloved clients, who weren't aware we would be participating, saw us on TV and congratulated us on the victory. Result, a couple of unexpected moments of brief and national fame. No, it was actually fame, spelled with capital letters. It was a unique chance to expose the name of Beetle to the widest possible audience and show them what we're capable of, and we couldn't miss it. We have loads of the fondest memories, the wonderfully crazy experience, the thrilling creativity, the pride of the production department, and without a doubt, the new aero modeling and aviation skills that we now have in-house. We made use of a world-famous event for self-promotion and are not planning to stop there. And in conclusion, here's what we wanted to particularly emphasize. When you want to be the best, go and soak the Montu test. Когда совсем не в моготу, не бойся намочить Монту!